But you were asked to be vetted for vice president. And your response is? My commitment is to the people of Michigan. Governor Gretchen Whitmer shutting down the speculation of her taking on the role is vice president. Good evening. I'm Amaya Kuznicki. Tonight, Governor Whitmer was in East Lansing promoting her memoir, True Gretch, but she couldn't dodge the questions that everyone wants answers to whether or not she'll take part in higher office. I went to see if she wants any part as a VP possibility. Her answer is pretty clear. There's lots of speculation. I can tell you this and I've been consistent and it's totally genuine. I've made a commitment to serve out my term as governor here. That is 100% where my head is at. On Tuesday, Governor Gretchen Whitmer's book tour made a stop in East Lansing. Hundreds of people gathered to learn more about the Michigan governor, reading between the lines of her plans for the future. At the book signing, she reflected on all of the work she's accomplished so far as governor. I have been through a lot, especially I think these last six years as a state and certainly in this in this role uh, 28 recall attempts you all weren't counting but i was <laughs> uh, survived you know the the pandemic the intense flooding that overwhelmed midland we had to evacuate 10,000 people in the middle of the night in the middle of a pandemic um, because bridge, bridges and the dams were washed out um, demonstrations for racial justice in the wake of george floyd's murder we have um, gotten through a lot of really tough stuff. She was joined by former Michigan Governor Jim Blanchard. He says even though Whitmer is turning down the vice president slot now, he thinks she will eventually be asked to serve in higher office. At some point, the leaders in Washington are going to want her to play a role. It could be cabinet, it could be an ambassador. But for now, for the next two years, she's really committed to serving the people of this state. She enjoys it. She doesn't have to run again. She can't run again. So it's easier to enjoy governing when you don't have to run again. Whitmer says she's confident Kamala Harris will pick the right person as her VP. She adds that November's election is critical and pushes all Michiganders to cast their ballot. A live look over the capital city tonight. We saw some pop-up storms today. Andy Provenzano is in the Weather Center to tell us what's in store for tonight. Hi, Andy. Hi, Amaya. Welcome back, by the way. Uh, we do have some showers coming through the area. There's a cold front that still has to get here, and you can see it really well on radar. We got some lightning in this. Wasn't much lightning in what we saw earlier this evening, and still some good downpours. You look at the US 127 Skycam, part of the Meridian Group. Occasionally you 